black walnut, Juglans nigra, and the Juglandaceae, or the walnut family, one of the most valuable timber species in all of North America. Black walnut is also known for its delicious tasting fruit, which here we're looking at an immature sample, and they'll get about the size of a tennis ball when they're mature. The leaves on black walnut are pinnately compound, consisting of these very lance-shaped leaflets. And when you crush the leaves, they have a very distinctive smell. The bark is interlacing, like many hardwood tree species. But when you look at the interlacing ridges, and when you cut them with a knife, you see that they're very rich, chocolatey brown color, much like a chocolate brownie. And that's very much what the wood looks like. It's why it's such a valuable wood. It's a hardwood and really used for some of the finest furniture and all kinds of specialty items. Black walnut is an interesting tree in that it's believed to be allelopathic or harmful to other species of plants. In fact, if you plant tomatoes and potatoes and maybe members of the pine family under this tree, you'll notice a real unusual curling of the leaves over time that is believed to be due to those allelochemics or those chemicals that the tree releases. And yet there are many other species that seem to grow very fine underneath black walnut. So the extent to which this tree is allelopathic is really up to debate and really has not been very well ascertained. Black walnut does not live very long, about 150 years, but it does grow very fast in between. It has a wide open canopy. You can actually grow a nice lawn underneath it. Black walnut, Juglans nigra, very high value timber species and producer of delicious nuts.